Matt Wetzel. Man, I've known him for years and years, but I don't know if it's Matt Wetzel. I know him as Junkie. How are you, sir? Good. Good to finally see your place. This is a pretty cool place with a lot of yellow. Yeah. It's your favorite color. It's one of them. Well, let's challenge him to a Gladiators of Steel against Matt's Off-Road Recovery. Gladiators of Steel against Matt's Off-Road Recovery. Team Heat Demolition Derby. A four-man team. Four on four. One and done. One and done. He took it relatively well with the exception of one thing. Um, I think I'm in, but only if you're one of the drivers. You're bringing me out of retirement. I'm gonna bring you out of retirement. So it was almost like a twist behind my arm. What am I gonna say? Drive all the way to St. George for a challenge and say no? Okay, so we've got a four on four, one and done. Correct. Cars. Cars, yeah, no trucks. I won't do trucks. Yeah, me either. I'm done with trucks. So gladiators of steel versus Matt's Off-Road Recovery and friends. And friends, you pick your weapon. <laughs> and I get to choose my partners. You choose your partners. If you think you got enough friends that would like to do this. Hey Siri, call Paul Cox. As a promoter, we put on different types of shows and we started putting on truck shows. And Matt and Paul Cox would come to a show in the trucks and they were dominating the shows for years. How would you like to come out of retirement for a one and done? Sounds like a good time to me. Hey Siri, call Robbie Layton. This is not Calling good. Hello? Hey, good afternoon. I got you on speakerphone with Gumby here. How's it going? Pretty dang good. Better if you say yes, but Gumby has challenged me to a four on four uh, derby, one and done. Okay. And uh, I, I said I was in. If he would drive, he said he'll drive. I'm building my team right now. I'm asking you if you want in. <laughs> well, if Gumby's driving, this is the one and only opportunity I get to hit him, I'm in. I've done demolition derbies for about 17 years. And in those years, I've never actually had the opportunity to derby against Gumby. You know, it's been probably about eight years since I've seriously driven in a derby um, and built cars. He's going to come out of retirement. We're gonna derby against him and put him back into retirement. The Gladiators of Steel, I have no idea who those three are gonna be, but all I heard in the conversation is, do you want to derby against Gumby? So naturally I agreed. You know, we're going into a show with some of the heaviest hitters in Utah. You know, Paul Cox, Matt Wetzel, Robbie Layton. That hurts already thinking about it. These are all cold calls, by the way. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Hey, Rudy, I'm uh, I'm here with Gumby, okay. and Gumby just extended a challenge to me to a four-man team derby against the Gladiators of Steel. I said I'm in if Gumby's one of the drivers. He said he would. So I'm assembling my team here. I've got Paul in, I've got Robbie in, and I'm asking you if you want in. That sounds like quite a crew. I would love to be a part of that. Am I running under Matt's Off-Road Recovery or Junkie? Maybe a little bit of both. Years ago, Matt was a driver that was driving every two, three weeks, and we always got to see him throughout the summer. But then along came COVID, and then he tried. He came up with this wild hair idea to do Matt's Off-Road Recovery, which just on YouTube blew up, and it's so entertaining and fun. And when he did that, he sort of didn't have the time to do derbies anymore. Believe it or not, somebody says Matt Wetzel, I think Junkie. I don't think right. Matt's off-road. I really think Junkie, so. Well, we had a heck of a run. It was, I think it was nine or 10 years. So Matt would put his cars together like a little hatchet job. I mean, headers bent. It made the cars look like they were just piece here, a piece there, put together like sort of like Frankenstein car. But they were actually masterfully built, well thought out, that he could figure out where the truck was gonna bend. And if it bent here, this part would say, you know, he, he's a very smart cookie and he likes to put stuff together and make things very unique. Demolition Derby has its fingerprints all over these builds. How many hours do you have into that new wrecker? I have no idea, a year. A year, 
of working on it, I would say, and it depends on what you call work because there's actual time on it and then there's every waking second thinking about it. All right, so we've got Gladiators of Steel versus Team Moore and Friends. Exactly. All right, I'm in. Wasn't quite expecting the team that he built. It is a monster team. Experience, hard hitters, know what they're doing, and they're gonna bring it to us. So we're like, all right, we've got to match that. I don't even care who the other three are. I think it's just gonna be fun to be out there with Gumby and be able to retire him again. I've always wanted to run against you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm in. May the best man win. Let's party.